breaking news nigerians nlc president ajaro hospitalized after brutal police attack <laughs> what is going on in nigeria the president of the nigerian labor congress nlc comrade joe ajaro has been hospitalized after being brutally attacked by police officers during a union protest in Imo State. Ajaro's right eye is completely shot and he has suffered other injuries, according to NLC Head of Information and Publicity, Comrade Benson. Benson said Ajaro was beaten, blindfolded, and taken to an unknown destination where he was further brutalized. His phones, his money, and other personal effects were also taken from him. This newspaper has learned. Benjamin said, contact has been made with Congress President Comrade Joe Ajaru this evening around 15.30 hours at the police hospital in Uweri from where he was taken to Federal Medical Center, Uweri, where he is receiving medical attention. This development follows a statement by the Imo State Police Command denying the arrest of the Imo State in the labor leader. Police Public Relations Officer Konye Henry said, contrary to reports, Ajaro was placed in pro protective custody. It is pertinent to state that the NLC president was in Uweri as part of arrangement of the Congress to mobilize workers for a mega protest rally in the state, the police said. In the course of their planning, it was reported that suggestions arose for the lockdown of some essential facilities, particularly the airport, which led to some workers and other individuals resisting the pocketing process leading to Stafford's the heated argument and an eventual attack on the person of the president by a mob. Upon receiving this report, the Imo Police Command swiftly deployed police operative to the scene where the officer in charge exercised is operational discretion by taking the NLC president into proactive protective custody at the state command headquarters to ensure the protection of his life and that he was not linked in the scuffle that followed. So which one we go believe now? <laughs> which one we go believe now? It was earlier reported that the NLC president Ajaro arrested was arrested in Imo State. The development took place as hoodlongs descended on protesters, smashing vehicles and inflicting wounds on labor members. At the time this was happening, people were running for safety. Ajaro had earlier directed all members of the union and affiliate uh, unions to all sectors in Imo State, including air, land, and sea, as the union commands protects today. Nigerian News learned that Ajaro announced the commencement of the protest at the end of the Central Working Committee, CWC meeting, held in the late hours of Tuesday, October 31st, 2023, in Uweri, the state capital. The NLC president had accused the Imo state government, Obu Zodema, of evaluating and neglecting workers' welfare. He alleged that due to the hostile actions of the governor towards workers in the state, many of them have died because of the lack of payment of their salaries. Speaking further, Ajaro lamented the non-compliance with the national minimum wage by the state government why accusing Hosodema of refusing to implement previous agreement, especially the accord reached on Gen January 9, 2021. You see this one now, eh? Waiting just to happen to this man. I just sorry for him. 
honestly speaking. I'm sorry for him because the, he might not be taken seriously. You understand? Do you know why I said this? So many a times, Nigerians had expected that this man would do something, you know, before you see, he go back out and all that. Look at, is the way you present yourself, that is how people will treat you. Is the way you present yourself, that is how people will treat you. If not, why would such a thing happen to him? You see, I don't even know where this country is going to. I don't know where we are going to. Too many things, so many things that you cannot even expect or even think about. It's happening in Nigeria. Nigeria has become a kind of lawless, lawless state that people can just come and act and nobody is being held accountable for all these deeds. So with what is happening now, you cannot believe that Nigeria is already a fake state. It just didn't yaga, yaga, yaga. You understand? Everywhere is scatter, scatter. How can this be happening? Is it not somebody that, that sent those food lungs to the protesters? This is what this government always do. I don't come up for the, 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 the president, the, the NLC president, Matau. But let's just talk about people who always employ um, food lungs to attack protesters. The same government who came through protest. How do you want people to relate to you? To relate with you. How? If people are aggrieved, not be true protest, they go to tell you, say, see, we don't like this thing that is happening. We want you to do this and do that and all that. Why is it that any time protest like this, you go feel say they won't take over your government? In Imo State again. This one now not be federal stuff for. This one, Naimo State. Now the police don't deny. Say no be them. Then take him. They won't protect him. You they see something now. But labor they talk say na police. Now they attack the president. May God show us mercy in Nigeria. So guys, let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to share this video. Share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you.